Okay. All right. Well, it's Dr. Gordon Linda here. New Year's edition of Facebook Friday coming out of the Southeastern Fertility. It's a whole new year, Linda. Yay. 2021. See you later. 2022. Come on in. That's right. Along with Omicron. Everywhere, apparently. Oh. I know. That's ah, nothing, I'm right? Just tired That's right. That's right. All right. All right. <laughs> so, um, I always talk about waiting today because yesterday we were really waiting. What were we waiting for? We were waiting to be dumped on with just the snowstorm of the century here in Oslo. I Oscar. was so excited. It was just so going to be excited. epic. I mean, I was thinking get the milk, get, get the, the toilet bread. paper, get the get the bread, bread you know, and, and, and they were sold out everywhere and you couldn't get anything. Mm -hmm. And then this is what happened. Nothing. Like nothing. Okay. Yeah. So this is the scene we want. It's kind of a cool wintry scene. Yeah. Right? That's yeah. snow there, right? Right. Yeah. But yeah, and that's what we got. We got just nothing. Waiting is hard, right? I was so right? very excited. Right? We were so excited. We were waiting. We waited for Christmas. Then we were waiting for New Year's. Then we were waiting for the big snowstorm. And sometimes you get sick of waiting. Yeah. You know, I'm sick of waiting. Okay. Yes. I went. I went to the orthodontist. And I thought I was going to get my braces off on the bottom, and he's like. No, probably a couple more months. I'm like, what? And you know, <laughs> and, and I don't know how it feels now. We tell the patients, you're not ready. We gotta wait. And so I usually, I don't like tell them that. So I say, you know what? I asked Linda, and Linda <laughs> said, you're not ready. So you have to wait until March or May or something. Cause I'm not gonna take the fall for that one. Right? It's Linda. He won't. Yeah, he's he won't. Right. That's right. Back. Right. So, you know. Because I'm mean. And you I'm are mean. It, it is, why, why do we make them wait? Why are we telling you you have to wait? Why can't, like the patient we were talking about the other day, who was just like, let's just jump right in, even though none of the test results are back. Why are we, why do we tell them to wait? Well, because we have to wait till we get all the test results back and the patient is in their best possible health that they can be in. So they have the best, best, best possible chance of having a successful cycle and a pregnancy That's right. and a baby. That's right, so you gotta wait and sometimes that means, you know, I don't like the way the cycle's going. I don't like the hormones. You got a cyst, your progesterone's up, blah, 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 right? I mean, and that's the thing. You're exactly right. You want the success. And yes, having to wait another month is not great, right? No. It's frustrating. I, I get it. You know, I wasn't happy for the doctor to say, well, I think we need to wait on your braces. But I also was kind of like, how come I don't like you? Anyway, that's, <laughs> anyway, that's all right. But, <laughs> I, I do think it, it is important for patients to know we're not doing those things to be mean, right? No. I mean, that's why, I mean. And we hate to we tell hate, you that hate to, That's why I make you guys tell because I'm like, <laughs> I'm not telling you that, right? And Brooke the other day, right? Yeah. Brooke had to tell the patient something she didn't want to hear and, and Brooke did such a great job and it all worked out. It did. So do you remember when we were waiting to meet our special guest, like on our Christmas edition and he escaped? Yes, he, well, he, he did. Well, he's right over there. That's our oh. painter, David. So say hey, hey David, now on Facebook Friday. It's live. All right. So you need any high quality painting done and you live anywhere around Knoxville, David, David Asbury is your man. And we will, we, we yeah. don't even get a commission for the work, but he has to do our work here and then our Bikini's house and then my house and then other people that we like, mm -hmm. their houses. But you got to be nice or else. We don't let David go work for you. So, that's right. That's right. But anyway, so exactly. that's right. We've been waiting. We've been waiting for the construction project. Yes. Right? We're waiting, waiting for, you know, why is this full of waiting? supposed to start in December. It's supposed to start in December. December yes. what year? Last year. Last year. All right. So <laughs> so waiting is a part of life. Right? But then we yeah. found out there's, there's like codes for fire, like fire safety and that's just doors ridiculous. you have to have. I mean, it's just crazy stuff. I mean, that's not America. No. America is all about ignoring the codes. That's right. Right. I mean, come on. I, I mean, mean wow. especially here in Tennessee. Yeah. Are there codes in Tennessee? No. No. Right. There's, so there's codes. That's right. <laughs> so, well, the owner of the building is such a is, is just so particular about these things. Okay. I guess we just have to do it by code. And I gonna, guess so. I'm gonna have I'm gonna have Mrs. Keenan talk to that owner because yeah, she lives with them. So that's right. <laughs> Well, anyway, so it's all about waiting. It's all about being patient, right? Sometimes it's not and our time, it's God's time. It's yes. hard to wait on God's time, right? We want things to go by our time with waiting mm -hmm. God's time. So finally, uh, one thing we're going to be waiting for is, it, isn't there a, when does the Mandalorian come back? I don't know, but I, I keep checking. Yeah, so again, we're waiting. 
to learn more about Baby Yoda. Baby Yoda. For Baby Yoda, right? Baby Yoda, this is, Carol had, had got me Baby Yoda for, for Christmas, and uh, so we will wait for Grogu to come back, and, <laughs> and, and that's going to be worth waiting for as well. Does he talk? Right? We can get to him. He does sort of talk, but I, I haven't really worked on my Grogu voice. I just do Main Yoda voice. Oh. And I can do it. Okay. All right. <laughs> In any case, so... It's a new year. We hope for all of you this will be a year that's a great year. You know, that's a year that, that you hopefully you have many your of your baby. dreams, you have your baby or you get pregnant, your dreams come true. Yes. And just remember that if you have to wait for going to a cycle a little bit later, it was Linda's fault and not mine. Because I, I would let it go. Is that mean Linda? No. <laughs> anyway, well, uh, next Friday. We'll be back. We'll be back. We'll be back for more. So y'all, and maybe welcome. we'll have a snowstorm out there. And maybe, maybe. Welcome to 2022. We hope to see y'all in person. You know, hope starts here. So we really want you to, to reach out to us. You know, we have the pre doxy calls. Come on in and make this the year that that, that you've been hoping for. And happy New Year. Happy New Year and goodbye COVID. That's right. Right. No more. Well, it's always been no a more. No more. So what? No. I, I don't know what it is. Bye, y'all. Have a great day.